herself to him. So he knew within herself that he, she really cared. So that's how he is about you. He know you love him when you give more of yourself to him. Amen. When you spend quality time with him. You're not asking for anything, but you're embracing him. You're loving him. You're thanking him. And you're spending time with him in the word. So she, so he knew she gave more of her self than you did. You bite me in, but you didn't give me nothing. See, that's what's wrong with the body. They, we invited me in, but we don't give him nothing. We give more of ourselves righteous than righteousness. Amen. 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 All right, come on. Y'all getting quiet and quiet. For she loved much, but to whom little is forgiven, the same loveth little. See? Hallelujah. But to whom little is, is forgiven, the same love look. What he's telling them, all right, he loved her. She gave more and she released. And they thought that, but they gave him look. Mm -hmm. They didn't give Jesus what's right for due to him. Y'all tell the truth now. Amen. She released, but she gave more than one that's supposed to be. Mm -hmm. This is what he was saying. Y'all supposed to love me more than she did. But y'all give me love when she gave it much. She gave all of herself. Amen. So when you give all of yourself, you're giving to the place that he begin to fill you with his spirit, which is the Holy Ghost, that you will feel his love when you don't feel, you don't feel love. Because he said, I sit back to comfort, which is the Holy Ghost, shall what? Lead and guide you into all truth. Then what if Jesus said in 48? And he said unto her, Thy sins are forgiven. He told her your sin is what? Forgiven. Forgive. How do you feel? Do you feel like you forgive? Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jesus. See, you got to feel that. Mm -hmm. Feel it and know it. Mm -hmm. Some people don't feel like they are forgiven. You know, they still talk about what? The past. Amen. Yes. Amen. And when you talk about the past, you stay, you are You're asking, there. you ain't in the past, <laughs> but you got the past in your mind, you Amen. end up going back into your past. That's true. And the world wants to keep you in your what? Past. That's why he said you in the world, but you're not of the world. I'm in the world, but I'm not of the world. Thank you, Jesus. I'm not going to act like the form of the world is the. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. So what I'm doing is I'm still keeping myself tied down in my past life. Amen. See, that's what the strive and the Pharisee were doing with that woman. Mm -hmm. They was keeping her in her past life. Amen. And when she came to Jesus, her sin was what? Forgiven. Amen. Jesus don't forgive you. When he died on the cross and he went back to heaven, he loosed forgiveness on us. Yes, it is. Thank you, Jesus. You loose. Thank you, Lord. Why are you holding on to something that you loose from? Mm -hmm. You loose from it. You loose from sin. Through Jesus Christ, Jesus said, I don't know, no, I don't know your sin. If you accept me, I accept you for who you are. Through him. And when you receive the Holy Ghost, you become what? The righteous of him. She came righteous. How much confidence did you have in you? That's a key thing. How much confidence did you have in you? Jesus got great confidence in you. But how much do you have in you? She had enough confidence in herself that if I can get in there, get to the righteous one. 
I will be made the righteous of him whole. We got to get in a place to feel like we are the righteous of God. I have just as much right as somebody else. Amen. I might not live in the best town they live in, best house they live in, but I am the Amen. righteous of Him. Amen. Amen. So I'm rich in Him. Amen. My confidence is not in myself and in stuff. My confidence is in Him. Amen. So the woman's confidence was in Him. So that's why He could tell the woman, God offer giving. But you got to feel that you are forgiven. Amen. Some people don't feel that way. Amen. But you are forgiven. Amen. Verse 49. And they said at me with him, begin, and they that said at me with him begin to say within themselves, Who is this that forgiveth sins also? That see, look, they still mumming about what Jesus said. Mm -hmm. And that's where it is today in the body of Christ. Yeah. The body of Christ keeps mommy. And Jesus said, I don't forget it. Mm -hmm. We hold people back. Mm -hmm. Amen. We forget mm -hmm. what we done did. Yeah. See, I can understand. Mm -hmm. When a uh, girl have a baby out of wedlock. Amen. Cause I need it. Amen. Amen. See, I can understand that. <laughs> That's right. Amen. True. So I can't do knock you out. That's Amen. Right. Amen. Jesus forgave me. Amen. Amen. Thank the Lord. So I can hold nothing. Amen. Jesus. Come on, y'all. Amen. Y'all get so quiet on me. Y'all. Amen. Y'all can't get the prayer <laughs> seat <and> straight. <laughs> 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 To know Jesus in the fullness of who he is. Mm -hmm. He don't see your sin. He see you for who mm -hmm. you are. Through your sin, he's looking for the righteousness yeah. of him in you. Mm -hmm. That you love him enough to trust him with your life. Yeah. See, the woman trusted Jesus with her. Because she was who she was. They didn't say she was a sinner. Because... Yeah. They don't even did uh, the Pharisees tried did not deal with Gentile, mm -hmm. but she risked her own self to go in to Jesus. Mm -hmm. See, when Jesus won't you, mm -hmm. the enemy can't touch you, mm -hmm. but he can put objects in your way to make you thinking that you ain't getting there. Mm -hmm. But you got to keep what pressing, mm -hmm. pressing. I might fall there, but I'm getting right back up. Amen. Amen. I might go back out there again. I'm still getting up. A baby going to start walking when it's small. It started as a baby stay. Then it come up. Amen. But see, we forget heavy. We try to drink that heavy milk. It's not just the infidel meal. <laughs> That's right. That's true. Come on, y'all. Let's look. What is it? So she knew who she was. Mm -hmm. Amen. Oh, so she important. took her time. So she went into it and just, she did what her heart felt towards you. And then they couldn't understand it. And all that was going on, they still didn't give Jesus nothing. Mm -hmm. And but look what Jesus said in verse 50 to the woman. He didn't say nothing about them. Oh, he said, y'all didn't give me nothing. <laughs> but to the woman, he said, and he said to the woman, thy faith has saved thee. What saved her? Her faith. Her faith saved her. Mm -hmm. Your faith will save you. Amen. Your faith saved you. Saved thee. It was her faith that saved her. She was no more a sinner. She was saved. Amen. So she what? She done progress. Amen. She done moved up. Yes, moved up. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. I hope some of y'all moved up with what I'm talking. Amen. Amen. You you ain't what men say Amen. you are. Thank you, Jesus. You are saved. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. you are saved according to the righteous of Him. Amen. 
Amen. It's what, how you feel about you. Amen. 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 I have seen some people got a good life and still feel like they ain't got a life. Amen. 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 What you say? He said, by faith, that saved thee. Now, if she didn't believe that, she'd have went right back to her her stage of what she came out of. You see, sometimes people go right back to the same thing. <laughs> they return back to their own body. Amen. See, you got to stay with the heat. Don't, don't stand off on it. If you done done something, this is the thing people do and I know that they ain't never fail. They do something wrong. Commit fornication, whatever. Instead of coming into the church, we go out the church. Amen. And when you go away from it, you end up losing what you the relationship there because you won't feel it anymore. Amen. I can break this down further than this. You get involved with a person. And you and him fall out. If he stay away from you two, three weeks, you don't feel about him like you did from the beginning. Y'all tell the truth. Amen. Amen. That's true. I don't want them to say I know better. Y'all can't say y'all can't jack me over. Amen. Say this, I'm almost 63 years old and ain't nothing about y'all that changed from my age time. Amen. All thank them, y'all got them high shoes on. The big earrings. I wear all this hair. <laughs> but y'all got the same mind that I had when I was coming out. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hallelujah! Oh, y'all won't say hallelujah. But that's true. Amen. 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 They think they're jacking me over, but I know <laughs> that. Right. If I yeah. sit down and talk to them and start talking about yeah. myself, yeah, you're right. <laughs> we got that same man. That's right. Uh, let me tell you, I tell you, man, see you with you. We think we get these babies. I got it. Nope. <laughs> you ain't got jacked. That's Amen. Right. That's not so. <laughs> that's not so. Thank you. Thank you. Amen. 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 Thank you. Thank you. Y'all being real. Amen. That's right. See, I'm trying to show Jesus, trying to show you if you hook up with me. There you go. I'm only going to take care of you and the baby. I'm going to give you a man going to love you like I love Amen. you. Amen. You love the baby. Amen. Thy faith will save you. He ready to what? Save you. Amen. If your faith will get in him and be committed to him and serve him in the fullness of holiness, the righteousness of him within your heart, and you watch God. Amen. Amen. Watch him. Watch him. The woman gave her all to him. And he said, Thy faith has saved you. And what else he said by thy faith? Go in peace. Then he told us that, go in peace. <laughs> we ain't go, we don't go in peace. He said, you, uh, you say, go in peace. Go in peace. We try to reach, kill, eat something. And there's no peace. When he do something, it is peace. Hallelujah. I feel something. I don't Amen. know what to tell right. All right. Just look over chapter 8. Uh, chapter 8. Stay in Luke. Chapter 8. 47 to 48. Just stay in Luke. Turn over to Luke 8 chapter 8. 47 to 48. The way you see it. 
And when the woman saw that she was not hid, she came trembling and falling down before him. So when she saw that she wasn't hid, she trembled and she fell before him. She declared it to him before all the people. She told the truth what? Before all the people. She didn't hide nothing. She said it before after she was, she was, I'm going to use that word, she was busted. Mm -hmm. Y'all understand me with that. Yeah. She was busted. So she came before the being. What did she do? Well, what cause she had touched him? What cause she touched him? And how she was healed immediately. And immediately she was healed. See, in the Old Testament, a woman couldn't go out. That's true. When she was on her, she couldn't go out. That's why she was in, when I talked about life, she was trimming and scared because two days she could have got killed by them mm -hmm. and then she would die with the disease. Mm -hmm. right. So she had a choice. So I got to do one of the two. I ain't going to let these people stop me. How many times people done stop you? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. For what they saying to you. Mm -hmm. So she couldn't hide herself. She was trembling. She was all nervous and scared. So, but she admitted in front of these people. And what happened in verse 48? And he said unto her, Daughter, be of good comfort. Thy faith hath made thee whole. Go in peace. Now if that says she was trimming and nervous and going on, so Jesus told her, Daughter, be of good comfort. He said, Girl, stop worrying about that. Come, stop worrying. Why are you comfort? Be of good comfort. Thy faith hath made thee whole. Then he told her, I said, Go in peace. Be a good cop. Go in peace. Because you can't change nothing. So be a cop. If I say it is true, it's true. If I say I done did it, it's done. Do you believe that it's done? I believe it. All I got to do is stand on the word of God and believe what it says. Yeah. Yeah. How much do we believe? Chrissy. Uh, Chrissy. I, Chrissy. We just type in, I believe if I see it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We won't see something. Okay. I won't see that. Girl, I ain't going to believe till I see it. What you say? I ain't call it. Girl, I got the grip. I don't believe till I see it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's the problem today. We want to see and not believe. It's easy to see something because I ain't got to put no effort to it. But if I believe it, I'm putting some effort to it. See, that's what the woman put some effort to it. She believed it and she put some effort to it. She came and put herself out there on the, what's on the line. Mm -hmm. See, you got to put yourself out there on the Because he can't get no glory out of until you put yourself out there. And see, when he, you put yourself out there, then you know that God is who he say he is through Jesus Christ. Because he want to be what? Glorified. So Jesus put himself out there in, on, hallelujah, in the Father's name so the Father could be glorified. So Jesus ready to be glorified through you, through your faith, if you believe that He is the Son of God. Yes, thank you, Jesus. Amen. Lord Jesus, amen. Oh my God. So He out there with me. I'm on the line, y'all. I'm on the line. Amen. And I'm on. He gonna get His glory through my life. Amen. Thank through my God. faith and believing in Him. Amen. amen. Thank you, Jesus. What I'm telling you, it hit me too. Mm -hmm. Amen. It ain't comfort to me neither. Amen. Just like it ain't comfort to you. I'm in a place that I've never been before. Remember when Jesus told Peter, said, Peter, lunch out in the... See, we stand in the shallow water. Amen. Jesus tired of being in the... Shallow I want, I want you to turn on. Oh, God, baby, did you all say that? I want you to go to Luke 17, 11 through 19. Mm -hmm. 
And it came to pass, as he went to Jerusalem, that he passed through the midst of Samaria and Galilee. And as he entered into a certain village, there met him ten men that were lepers, which stood afar off. Now these men had lepers. They, ten men. Now we were talking about the woman all the time. Now we talking about men now. Mm -hmm. These men had lepers. He was coming through. They had issues. They had a disease. Mm -hmm. They couldn't even go into the city. Mm -hmm. Now look what happened. And they lifted up their voices and said, Jesus, Master, have mercy on us. Okay, they look, They didn't look at the circumstances of what they bought, the disease they had. They asked Jesus to what? Have mercy upon him. Them. Let me say this to y'all. Don't y'all know Jesus don't have no respect for the person? Amen. 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 They, got, they didn't even deal with them. Jesus could have went the opposite way. Mm -hmm. But Jesus didn't feel the way the Pharisees strive for. Mm -hmm. They he they holler, have mercy upon us. How many times we gonna holler that? Amen. Oh, Amen. Have mercy upon us. Who is that? And look what happened. Let me show you guys. Let me show you. And as he entered the verse 14, sorry. And when he saw them, he said unto them, Go show yourselves unto the priest. See, he told them now when he saw them, he told them, Go show yourself to the priest. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sometimes he wants something to be. Go show yourself to the priest. Okay, what he said. And it came to pass that as they went, they were cleansed. All right. They left out with the left. Yes. Oh, so y'all ain't caught that. Mm -hmm. Get it. Mm -hmm. They left out with it. Mm -hmm. But that faith, what Jesus said to them, he told them, go show yourself to the priest. And they went, they were getting healed. Yes, right. See, you can't stop. You got to keep Pressing your way. The more you keep moving, you getting healed. Yeah, Amen. That's why he told He didn't tell them they were healed right then. He said, go show yourself to the priest. Sometimes God talks to you in a foolish way. You say, I don't understand that. Do it anyway. Amen. It ain't for you to understand. It's to do it. So he told go show yourself to the priest. And they went. He began to, the healing began when they took their faith, what Jesus said, and moved. Sometimes God tells y'all to do something. Back sometimes to me. For me. And you said, today God. And then you hold your own stuff up. Because you don't obey. I'm using me as a vow. Sometimes it could be somebody else. Is that God telling me to do that? <laughs> so that God will try me. And see. Okay. And one of them, when he saw that he was healed, uh -huh. turned back. And with a loud voice glorified God. Okay, all of God here. Now see. Jesus. Now I'm going to show y'all different. Something I want y'all to see something. Okay, one turned back and thank you. Mm -hmm. The other one went their way, although they were here. Now, sometimes folks can be blessed. You can bless them, help them, and they won't even come back. I had somebody walk away from me and shame. <laughs> won't come back. So, see, Jesus knew within themselves they want to heal it, but they didn't want to. Come back. And you ever see somebody want to be blessed, but they don't want to serve the blessing? Uh -huh. That's where we are with Jesus. We want the healing, but we don't want to serve the blessing. Amen. We go the other way. All right, look what Jesus said. Go 15 there. And one of them, when he saw that he was healed, turned back 
And with a loud voice glorified God. Okay, he glorified, he was thanking God. Amen. 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 He was preaching, he was worshiping God, he was thanking him. Amen. And look what verse 16 said. And fell down on his face at his feet, giving him thanks, and he was a Samaritan. He fell down, worshiping, thanking him, and giving him, and he was a Samaritan. Mm -hmm. And Samaritan was not a part of the Jews. No, they but they were giving him what? Thanks. So that let me know Jesus don't have no respect for a person. Amen. 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 If you serve him in the food, he don't care if you white, blue, Chinese, That's Japanese, right. or whatever. That's right. Amen. Amen. Okay, look what happened. And Jesus answering said, Were there not ten cleansed? But where are the nine? Where are they? That was ten. Mm -hmm. Then one come back. Jesus asked the question, "Where, where are the other nine?" Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. See, he asked him, "Where, where, where yet? Mm -hmm. Where yet with me? Mm -hmm. are you with me, home girl? Are you with me?" <laughs> <laughs> that what he's saying. Amen. Is you with me? Thank you. A lot of people are not with, with him. Amen. It's a form of godliness and deny the power. I believe it if I can see it. It don't work that way. Amen. Ooh, glory to God. Verse 18. There are not found that return. There are not found that return to give glory to God. They weren't even found. Save the stranger. Ain't that Thank you, Jesus. Boy. I know that for a fact. <laughs> That's true. Some people ain't found it. I'm going to go on the book. You don't see him no more. Let's get back to you. And he said unto him, Arise, go thy way. Thy faith hath made thee whole. He told him now he was in the low class. Couldn't even go to town. He didn't even have nothing mm -hmm. but that disease. Yeah. But after he got here, Jesus told him, arise. So he was going. Mm -hmm. Once your faith get in the place and Jesus said, arise, that means he finna motivate you, raise you up, put you in the position that you ought to be in him. Mm -hmm. That he will be glorified Glory. according to your faith. When I prophesied to you about your business, you remember when I told you last week about the hairstyles and all these right here? As long as you give God what right to do it, God's going to raise you up and bring you to faith that your business will be higher than what you would even about to get here get the door right now. That's why you say, I rise, I rise you. Amen. Thank you, Lord. You don't rise yourself. He brings you up through your Amen. faith. That he may be what? Glorified. Mm. Don't try to make something happen because it ain't going to happen. But if you put him in, he's going to raise you. That's what he told me. Arise. Mm. Rise from your circumstances. Because you came back now for the care you. He said, Arise. Go thy way. Thy faith had made these whole. So the man was well. I thought about the woman when her son died, when she went to Elijah. Yeah. And when she went to Elijah, asked a question. She said, what? I spent like you said, what is the mouth? She said, it is well. Yeah. When she said it is well, her son got yeah. well. Sometimes I think I'm preaching to myself. All right. <laughs> It is a way. I do sometimes I'm saying him mm -hmm. saying stuff to y'all. Mm -hmm. Y'all look like this. Mm. <laughs> what is she saying? Uh -huh. But he's saying it is well. Your faith makes you well. Amen. If you got faith and believe in him, it is well. <laughs> God said, he said to him, 
Arise, go thy way. Thy faith has made thee whole. So you well. Well in everything in your life. Amen. Amen. Everything. Just to not only hear well in everything, your finance, your relationship with your children. Although they may not be, but it's well. It's well. Hallelujah. Say it is well. It's well. It may look like you're tearing down, but it's well. See, you got to say it by faith and believe what you say. Amen. You don't say it because I tell you say it. You say it because you believe, believe that. Yes. In your yes. faith. Yes. That is well. Yes. My God. Oh, my God. Here the Holy Ghost. I want to orchestrate your life. Amen. 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 I have to stretch your life. Sometimes all the time in having a big car, a right. big house, and that. If you can feel good on the inside of yeah. you, Amen. some of us don't feel start. good in here. Amen. You Amen. get up in the morning, you say, and you go to bed saying, yeah. when you can get up and be happy and enjoy life, you are well. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Lord knows I love peace. Amen. I want some peace. Yes. My God. Oh God, thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, flip over to Luke 18. Some of y'all looking for answers, but you ain't using your faith. Oh, man. All right. Yeah, true. I hear that? I hear that. I hold up this head. The woman used her what? So you got to use your? Start at verse 35. And it came to pass that us. 18 to 35. Excuse me. I'll try to the page. <laughs> All right. Go ahead. And it came oh, to pass you. that as he was come nigh unto Jericho, a certain blind man sat by the wayside begging. Okay. How many blind folk begging? Okay. Uh -oh. yeah. Let me break that down. Uh -huh. Now, right here, this man naturally blind. Right. Okay, but I'm going to use, yeah. we can see, but yet we, Lying. and we stand in what? Begging. He said ask, he didn't say what? Begging. So your faith don't beg. No. Amen. Your faith asks. Amen. Amen. <laughs> don't jump out, you get to pray, please, Jesus. Y'all, you please, y'all pray. I do. <laughs> Thank you, Liz. Give me yeah, five. <laughs> he said, ask. Uh. Thank you, baby. I'm <coughs> We want to see. So as to see it, we blind. And then you got to walk what? Blind faith. Faith is a seven. Hope for an evidence of thing, not what? So I ain't seeing it, but I be believe it. I believe it. I don't see it, but I believe it. I believe it. Hallelujah. So he's a beggar. Okay. Come on. And hearing the multitude pass by. And he was hearing the multitude pass it by. Oh, he couldn't see him, but he heard. Him. And look what happened. He asked what it meant. He asked what it meant. We will ask. What that meant? What, 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 why y'all hollering? What's going on out right there? What? What y'all doing all that hollering? Now he stopped begging and he went to being nosed. <laughs> And look what happened. And they told him that Jesus of Nazareth passed it by. Then they told him that Jesus is passing by. Now he was a beggar. 
He didn't know Jesus, but he heard him. But he began it. Now he was a bad. But uh, he stopped begging and we kicked in faith. So he see the value more in Jesus than was standing out here on the corner of bed. <laughs> see, you got to see where your value at. If I value that I stay out there, don't come and serve me, don't do nothing, don't pray, don't, uh, don't read my Bible, what value do I have? Is I'm going to stay out there begging? Or I'm going to Get nosy and see if my life can change. He told him that Jesus of Nazareth were passing by. What happened? When they told him, what did he do? And he cried. And he cried. He cried. Through his cry, his faith kicked in. And he cried. It's amazing. Something good going on, we don't pay attention to it. But something ain't up ahead of me. Boy, we in it, Cam. We in that. And look what it said. Say, Jesus, thou son of David, have mercy on me. See, he still hollering, have mercy on me, son of David. Now look what happened. And they which yeah. went before rebuked him. Now they told him, shut up! How many times people have told you to? Yeah. And you stop because they told you to. Yeah. <laughs> look at him. That he should hold his peace. Hold your peace. Shut up. Be quiet. Mm -hmm. Get out of the way. You a beggar. Stay. Jesus ain't stunning you. Come on, y'all. Hallelujah. Your barber said, you don't go, you must stay out of that old church. You don't need that. Girlfriend said, stay at home. You ain't acting like you spoke to with me. <laughs> Shut up! What you got all that for? You'll start changing. She told you stop doing that. Here you is, don't stop. Don't you know I'm more powerful than she is? She don't know what she talking about. Both are told you. Don't hold it, Pete. But look what he did. But he cried so much the more. So he kept out. You got to keep, your faith got to keep hollering. It's got to come out of your mouth. You just can't say it. Mm, Jesus. So true. I'm waiting on you, Jesus. <laughs> Where you at, Jesus? Mm, Jesus. All right. You got the hope. Yes, you, you hit your faith what you do. You don't sit there. You hope. So you got to. Your faith got the hope. Amen. Come on. But he cried so much the more. Thou son of David, have mercy on me. Mm -hmm. And Jesus stood and commanded him to be brought and unto him. Jesus stood. And command him to be brought to him. Because it was something about his holler was different than the other holler. Mm -hmm. wow. It's something different about you than he was somebody here. Amen. Yeah. Although you ain't saying that Jesus knows your faith. Amen. This message that come forth today, your faith is hollering out more than some of y'all sitting in here, yes. whoever is in here. Amen. Looking Amen. for an answer. Amen. Oh, my God. And you getting the answer. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. I'm getting the whole joke. Oh, I don't care mind. what you're saying. You I in here, you getting your answer. Yes, and you ain't hiding. Yes, Amen. Amen. The Holy Ghost done told you. Amen. Right. Amen. 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 It's all that different. You got to believe it and trust it and keep moving. Mm -hmm. 
All right, come on. And Jesus stood and commanded him to be brought unto him. And when he was come near, he asked him. He asked him. See, by faith, Jesus is going to ask you. You know, it's strange we, when we want something, we go around. Yes, we do. We'll be crying. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We say everything. And he said, What you want? <laughs> he already know. He said, hey. All right, the way he said. Saying, What wilt thou that I shall do unto thee? So Jesus turned around and asked him a question. What do you want me to do for you? Sometimes Jesus wants to ask you, what you want me to do for you? <laughs> Ask you a question. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He asked him a question. And what did the man say? And he said, Lord, that I may receive my sight. Okay, he asked you a question. And the man said, that I may receive my sight. When he asks you a question and he tells you, that, do you receive it? Mm -hmm. See, that's... Mm -hmm. See, a lot of times we don't get what we ask for by our faith. We don't feel like we're worthy enough. And then when you say you're worthy to have it, you don't receive it. When you ask for something, you got to embrace it. Amen. Then you got to receive it. Amen. If you don't receive it, you can't get it. Amen. And that's when your faith kicked in because you don't receive it. Amen. Amen. I receive mine. Amen. I receive it. I received what mm. was stored for me. Thank you. Amen. Mm. Receive it. You got to receive it by faith. Amen. Mm. Amen. Mm. He received it. Look what happened. And Jesus said unto him, Receive thy sight. Then see, he said, Rabbi said that I may he said that I may receive my sight. He said that. All right? Same word that he said to Jesus. Now look what Jesus said. And Jesus said to him, receive thy sight. So he spoke his own, his own sight into yes. existence. Yes. He asked the question. He said, I receive, I want to receive my sight. And Jesus turned around and said, Jesus said unto him, receive thy sight. Is how you re what you come to church for? You come to church to receive a word from the Lord, don't you? Amen. So you go to embrace that word <coughs> and receive what the word came for, because you see it in the word. And once you receive it and embrace it, then the word will go into the heart. And then it will manifest itself out through your heart and it will because you will speak it into Amen. existence. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. The man spoke his own sight. Amen. We don't speak it. We don't speak the word when you are praying. Just don't pray. Find it in the word and speak the word. And then that seed of the word of Jesus Christ will manifest what you say you want. It's in the word. You need to find that. My, my God should supply all my oh, needs according to his riches and glory. So if he's my money, I need some plow money. Yes. Money shall come to me now. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, God. If I need a healing, my healing that come to me now. Receive thy sight. Receive it. That's what he told him. Receive it. After he received the sight, then what he said, thy faith has saved me. Not only his faith uh, received his sight, his faith saved him. He got two things in one day. He got saved and he received his sight. See, Jesus knows how much value to give on to who? A reader. Let me read 43. And immediately he received his sight. Immediately he received his sight. 
and followed him. And he followed him, glorifying God. And all the people, when they saw it, gave praise unto God. Who? God got his what? Praise. I just said that this is what he wanted to do. He wanted to get his glory out of your life through your faith. Amen. That people can believe that he is real. Amen. But if you don't put your faith to action, he, that just like stunning him. Mm -hmm. See, we stun ourselves. We sit on the stool or do nothing. Amen. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. We don't tell the good news. If I got something good, you, I, I thank you. If Mason going out of business, ain't it? Ain't, oh, yeah. Yes, it is. It's going to see. I just said, look how psychic she got. <laughs> <laughs> She got excited because she know I ain't go out there and get a good sale on. <laughs> but see, the world ought to be so good to you. Amen. And it hope you you ought to be so excited. I'm going to tell I'm going to tell somebody. I'm going to bring her. Amen. Good God, so good. He brought me out. God, come on. Get up. Get up. Go with me, son. Get up. Get up. Come on. Come on. Call her. Come on, God. Come on. Come on. I bring her to church. Oh, God. Then she can get so good to her by Jesus. She reach out and get some. Come on, God. Come on. Come on. Jesus is doing a good thing. She had the church. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, come on, God. Come on. Come on. Come on. Good. Come on. Come on. Come on. Go, God. Come on. Come on. Good. Good. God doing a good thing. God. It's good. It's good. Come on. Come on. Go with me. She be straight and like your Lord. Come on, God. God, he got something. He got something. Amen. 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 And see, when it's something real good, and Jesus so good, then you fill in Jesus' house up. Yeah, but we yeah. sit up like this. Do that. <laughs> so God's house is not being added because you sit on the word, and the word it become dominant. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. If it's something, but it's a good piece of God. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, let me tell you about my shit. <laughs> come, 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 don't send that. Come on in this car over here. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh, let me tell you about it. He gets so good to her. See, we're spreading the lies. Yeah. He'll yeah. do so much. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. 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 Go back right. here. Uh -huh. See, I done pull her out. That's right. Come on, Jack. Uh -oh. I should have brought her on the church. Uh -oh. No, but I'm going to tell her a good piece of gospel. Uh -oh. That's right. So she's going to start not getting what she's supposed to get. Uh -oh. Okay, yeah, then. Here I go. Uh -huh. She go there and tell her good job. Uh -huh. Let me tell you something. Uh -huh. Let me tell you something. Uh -huh. you you need to come over here with us. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Look at all that dead stuff. Hey. When they, and that's where we do the body. Instead of telling the good stuff and pulling them in to find out what their life can be changed, we tell them old garbage stuff and they end up dying. And you sit up in the house. Thank y'all. You sit up in the house of God.